guys, welcome back to another video, and today we have my haul, my NASCAR diecast haul from Watkins Glen. I went to the NASCAR race today. Well, actually, I might, I might up, up, upload this tomorrow, but yeah, on Sunday, um, I went to Watkins Glen for the NASCAR race, and I picked up 24 different NASCAR diecasts. Uh, I believe 20 different drivers. I got like two of a few drivers, but yeah. So overall, the race was it was a really good race. Um, Denny Hamlin actually ended up getting his first ever road course win. Um, yeah, so that was a surprise. Obviously, he did get second earlier this year at the other road course, Sonoma, when Tony Stewart wrecked him in the second to last turn. I'm not sure what number it is because I'm not sure how many turns there are at Sonoma. But um, so yeah, he wrecked him there when Tony Stewart got the win. But Denny Hamlin won today. Martin Truex wrecked on the final lap. That was kind of funny. Jeff Gordon did okay. It was awesome to see him race. I n I never thought that I was gonna get to see him race again, but I did. And um, so yeah. By the way, I'm opening a couple of the cards behind camera as I speak. But yeah, the first one, the first driver that I'm gonna show you. Um, I actually got three paint schemes of one driver, and then two paint schemes of two different ones. Um, first I'm gonna show you the one that I got three different paint schemes of. And so far, I'm working on the second one to get it open. I should have opened them before the video, but yeah. Okay, I have two of them open, and one more of this driver, and then I'll show you it. Yeah, I sat near um, the turn where the if you saw the race, the turn where the where the um, like right where the Greg Biffle and Ricky Stenhouse wreck happened. I was like right there. That was co really cool to see, by the way. Okay, almost got it. Sorry for the long wait. Okay, I know I'm already two minutes into the video. Two minutes and 15 seconds almost now. So here is the first driver. I got three cars. This is the only driver that I got three cars of. First off is Kyle Busch. We got his M&M's paint scheme. Actually, for this video, I'll actually put the camera like this low. So yeah, that that's a really awesome paint scheme right there. The M&M's. This is my favorite driver, by the way. That's why I got three. But yeah, I got his M&M's. I'll put that off to the side, and then I got the interstate batteries, again another sweet scheme. He was driving these Snickers um, at Watkins Glen, but they did not, they were not selling that one. Then last but not least I have his championship car, the M&M's Krispies championship car from last year. Um, yeah, NASCAR Sprint Cup Series champion 2015. That was really awesome to see him win the championship, obviously it wasn't there, but yeah, I watched on TV, and yeah. Anyways, that is all of the Kyle Busch cars that I got right there. So, yeah, now, next up, um, I got two cars of the next driver, which I have to open. But, yeah, so I got two cars of the next driver, and then there's another driver that I got two cars of. And then I got 18, yeah, 18 different other, you know, seven. I don't know, something like that, different other ones, um, but yeah, so, I'll show you this one in just a second, there's one, and there's the other one, just gonna crack it open really quick, I would show you me opening these, but I'm like, really bad at opening these, like I just tear the whole box apart just to get the car out, but anyways, here, okay, I'm really struggling to get this one open, I'm sorry for the long way. Actually, after this one, I'll start pausing it in between um, me opening each car. Okay. Again, I apologize for the long wait. Oh, jeez, this video is already at four and a half minutes. Okay. All right, so the next driver is Dale Earnhardt Jr. I got his nationwide paint scheme. I really love this paint scheme. And um, it was cool to see Jeff Gordon, like I said, in the 88. He drove the Exalta, which uh, might be the next one I got. That I'm about to show you. It might not be. We'll see. But yeah, um, so there is the Nationwide. Then the other one is not the Exalta, but it is the Batman paint scheme in the Batman vs. Superman. But yeah, that is Dale Jr. So those are my Dale Jr. schemes and my Kyle Busch schemes that I got. But yeah, that's what I've shown you so far, and now it is time 
Jimmy Johnson. Okay, I am back, guys. And, um, yeah, I, I opened all the die casts. And like I said, the next one, which is the last one that I got more than one of, is Jimmy Johnson. The first one I got is his Lowe's. Pretty cool car. All these are really cool. And the next one is the Superman. So I got Dale Jr.'s Batman and Jimmy Johnson's Superman. So, so far, that is seven cars. And, um, yeah, so I have three Kyle Bushes, two Dale Juniors, two Jimmy Johnsons. And, yeah, so now I just have one of the rest of the drivers. First up is Kyle Larson, Target. By the way, before this, I had no 2016s. And, whoa. Look at how off-centered the 42 is. Like, how much white there is at the bottom right here. You know how high up the number 42 is. That's just sad. Um, but yeah, that's Kyle Larson. Then next up, we have Ryan Blaney. I was really happy to get this one. I'm actually surprised they were um selling this, selling this there. That is his Motorcraft scheme. Next up, we have Casey Kane's Farmers Insurance. Next up, Kurt Busch's Haas. I really like this scheme, the black and red, black and red. Um, yeah, so next up we have Jamie McMurray's Cessna. I love this scheme as well, it's got McDonald's on the side there. Beechcraft, so yeah. And then we got Chase Elliott's Napa. They also had 3M and Kelly Blue Book, but I got the Napa. Pretty, pretty cool. Um, oh geez, hang on one second. So my monster trucks just fell over. Okay. Anyways, um, next up, Danica Patrick's Nature's Bakery. Then we have Joey Logano's Pennzoil. And then Martin Truex Jr.'s Bass Pro Shops. Then I got Eric Almarola's Smithfield. And this one, I'm really surprised they had. And I got the last one. This one is super, super rare. It is Brian Scott. That's right, I got Brian Scott. This was the last one there. I'm so happy that I got this. Brian Scott. I never got Sam Hornish's number 9 Twisted T from last year. Brian Scott also drives Twisted T. But I got this scheme. I'm not even sure what it is. Albertson's Company's Shore Lodge. Yeah, so... Um, Albertson's Company Shore Lodge. Yeah. But, yeah, that is Brian Scott. And then, um, I have Matt Kenseth DeWalt USA. Wish I could have got, um, Kenseth Dollar General, but they were not selling it there, actually. Unless they sold out already, I'm not sure. But, yeah, that is Matt Kenseth. Next up, we have Paul Menard. Yeah, I really like this scheme. And then we have Ryan Newman's Caterpillar. And then we have Denny Hamlin's FedEx Office, the race winner. This was the only Denny Hamlin car they were selling there. I probably would have got um, the orange one. I forgot which one that is. Um, yeah, there's only two cars left. And actually, I'm going to put them... I'll show you them together. It is both of these that are on the bases... Um, Kevin Harvick's Jimmy John's and Brad Keselowski's Miller Lite. Um, I honestly don't understand why the Kevin Harvick's is on a stand. I mean, Jimmy John's is not a beer. I mean, yes, um, right here, my thumb is, it says Bush Beer, but I mean, the main sponsor on this is Jimmy John's. And then, um, Brad Keselowski's Miller Lite. Actually, hang on one second. Uh -huh. This is what it said for both of them. Like, it came... In the packaging, it said, This product is mounted to a base using a specialized screw as required by the licensor and or other regular regulatory agencies. Or regulatory, whatever. Can't speak today. But yeah, that is what it said, which is really weird, but... Oh, jeez, I just dropped Kevin Harvick right on top of Kurt Busch. Okay. Anyways, that is um, Kevin Harvick's Jimmy John's. Really like that scheme. I'm going to have to get both these off the bases. And then we have Brad Keselowski's light. Oh, wait, it's not even Miller light. It's just light, actually. Huh, funny. But yeah, guys, that is my 
um, Watkins Glen NASCAR diecast haul. Right now, I'm going to line them all up for you guys to show you. But yeah, I had, like I said, I had a lot of fun at the race. Um, yeah. Again, congratulations to Denny Hamlin for winning that race. Um, obviously going into it, nobody thought Denny Hamlin was going to win. Kind of a disappointment that Jeff Gordon did not, but it was awesome to get to see Jeff Gordon race in person one last time. In the beginning of the race, like when they say like who's starting where, and then they, like all the drivers in their uh, truck, there's only two drivers in each truck. Um, yeah, normally they do that. And when Jeff Gordon was in his truck, when it was going on, everybody was cheering so loud for him. It was awesome to see that, but yeah, at least I got to see him race one more time, although he did not win. There we go, guys. That right there is all the cars that I got. That is my Watkins Glen Hall. I got three Kyle Bushes, two Dale Juniors, two Jimmy Johnsons, Kyle Larson, Ryan Blaney, Casey King, Kurt Busch, Paul Menard, Ryan Newman, Denny Hamlin, Eric Almirola, Brian Scott, Matt Kenseth, Joey Logano, Martin Truex, Chase Elliott, Jamie McMurray, Danica Patrick, Kevin Harvick, and Brad Keselowski. There is five different drivers that I did not get there, which was Carl Edwards, Ricky Stenhouse, AJ Allmendinger, Austin Dillon, and Tony Stewart were the five that I did not get. But um, yeah, they did not have Trevor Bain or Greg Biffle actually. Then his teammate or their teammate Ricky Stenhouse, they did have. Um, I I actually was gonna get Ricky Stenhouse and AJ Allmendinger, but I did not have enough money and I had to put them both back. AJ Allmendinger, literally, I got the last one of that too, and it was really rare as well. But I had to put that one back. So with Ricky, same with Ricky Stenhouse. And um, I also did not get Tony Stewart or Austin Dillon or Carl Edwards, but I already have a Carl Edwards scheme from last year, which I did not get any other last year cars. I'm starting to get back into collecting NASCARs. I really haven't collected since 2014. But yeah, I have Carl Edwards' car from last year, which is fine. It fits it perfectly. And I also have a good Austin Dillon, Trevor Bain, Greg Biffle, Tony Stewart, Ricky Stenhouse, AJ Allmendinger, and I also have a good Casey Mears, which they were not selling there either. But yeah, and also later this year, I plan on getting all those along with David Reagan's Dr. Pepper. Um, they might be making Michael McDowell later this year as well, and any other new ones that they make of underfunded drivers. So happy they're making David Reagan and Michael McDowell again. I had never got him last year. Oh yeah, and I also have a 34. Um, it's actually David Reagan's 34, but I'm going to use it as Brett Moffitt. Yeah, or not Brett Moffitt. He drove it last year. I'm going to use it as Chris Busher. If I do a stop motion series, which the signups for um, the stop motion series will be coming up soon. I still have to think of a name. And yeah, for you Monster Jam fans, um, sign up series 70 having uploading troubles. I finished the event. It was 20 minutes and 3 seconds. It was an awesome event. But yeah, I'm having uploading troubles. Trying to get that up for you guys. But yeah, that's basically it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. 24 cars um, is what I got. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.